That's not what. Why Utah? Uh, what do you mean, why Utah? This is where he's from. The question, why Utah, implies that there was any conscious thought to Utah. That is where Wilbur is from. It's where he's been from for months. If you go back and watch earlier streams, you'll I've hinted at it. He's been from Utah for a very, very long time. Uh, why Utah? I guess his parents settled there. I don't know if they have any, any Mormon influence. I don't think they do. Um, I guess his parents settled there. I don't know if it was in Salt Lake or just outside around the area, but... Um, yeah, he settled in Utah, uh, and he was tired of his time in Utah, and so he got on a boat uh, at the at the sea that surrounds Utah, the big ocean around Utah, and he sailed to the Dream SMP. That's pretty simple. Uh, next, last question. Uh, oh, how did C. Wilbur get to know C. Tommy? Ah, that is a complex one. Let me let me think, because that one that one has a few layers to it. So. C. Wilbur and C. Tommy have known each other for an incredibly long time. For uh, as as Ghostbusters books would recount through history, they knew each other since since they were young. You know, they they were that was that was some of some of Wilbur's fondest memories were of Tommy when he was younger. But the thing is, uh, there is no proof that the Dream SMP is a tangential reality to our own. You know, so whilst it is possible to hop between these realities, it's also very possible that. The, the 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 machinations of the dream smp extend beyond the fabric of time you know there is nothing stopping you know uh, uh barack obama being on the dream smp you know there's nothing stopping little nas x from being on the dream smp you know the the dream smp and reality have a very tangential crossover and the utah of our reality might not be the same utah in the dream smp uh, and the Dream SMP's reality might be separate from Utah's. So, in, in, without just saying long, confusing words, Tommy and Wilbur, I won't be giving too much away, but Tommy and Wilbur could have known each other through this time period and then reunited through the Dream SMP, or they could have met earlier in the Dream SMP through another means some kind of other portal mechanism you you can you can think you you have a little think have a little examine work hard brains i said that was super simple the way i said it at the end it's all about realities the dream smp it always has been about reality what's real what's not you know think about it like like so when i started writing the dream smp right at the beginning it was all a political landscape it was a comedic a comedic pol political drama, right? And then slowly as other people got involved, uh, they started adding elements of reality and like, you know, what is real? What is fake? You know, am I asleep? Am I dreaming? Am I, am I awake? You know, what is pain? What is my relationship with people? You know, am I being possessed? Am I being controlled? Loads of these elements started coming in, which I really liked. I loved what Carl Jacobs was doing. I loved what Rambu was doing. I thought that was sick. And I, I, I love incorporating those elements into my own stories.